Hey guys, so MSP has recently made like a bunch of huge new updates to the downloadable version. I think because they're trying to get people to download it before Flash gets discontinued in like, I think honestly it's like a few days or a few weeks, but they've added a bunch of really cool stuff and I'm excited to share it with you guys. And the first thing is I'm pretty sure, like I'm not certain about this, but I think that the star coin wheels are doubled. I think usually on the non-VIP one, the lowest you can get is 20 and now it's 40. And I'm not sure about that. Also, I'm sorry about my fan. I can't do anything about it and it's really annoying and it's really loud. But besides the star coin wheel, they also added in a free spin on the fame wheel, which I'll show you in a second. And I also showed you guys in my last video. And I think it's really cool. But these are like the smaller updates that aren't as cool as the other two, which are like actually pretty crazy considering people have been asking MSP to add in that stuff for like years now and they never did it until now. So I'm pretty excited to show you guys that stuff but first let's spin the fame wheel i always get 500 okay whatever it's not like <laughs> i need any more fame anyway okay so the bigger updates all have to do with the clothing shops and the first one like look at this okay it speaks for itself now we have girls clothing and boys clothing and i actually thought that if they were to do this they'd add it into the same shop but there are separate shops which i guess kind of works better because because if they added in both the girls clothing and the boys clothing into one shop that would be really like messy and cluttered so i guess it works better this way honestly i don't really care for the boys clothing and i don't plan on using it but i do know that a lot of people have been asking msp to add it in for a very long time and so i think it's really cool that they finally have even if it took them like years but let's take a look The clothing actually fits really well and I'm not sure if they adjusted the clothing depending on the gender of your avatar, but I mean it looks like it fits pretty well. It doesn't look like guys clothing really. Anyways, you get the point. Now we have girl and guy clothing, which is really cool. And now let's go on to the next update, which I honestly could have stayed in the guy shop for, but we now have a search bar, which is really cool. And it's honestly really useful like if i want a pair of jeans i can just search jeans although i think there's already a category for that so that was kind of pointless but if i were to search like gold i could find a bunch of gold stuff and i guess it would be good for like if you have an aesthetics you can search like grunge and now you got a bunch of grunge stuff and also you can search by year which i think is cool I don't think it shows everything that was made then, but I'd say this was made in 2014. It looks like 2014 clothing, but I thought that was pretty cool. And then one thing that I noticed is if you don't search anything and you just press on like the search thing, the next week's theme shows up, which this is now this week's theme, but I was on here yesterday, which was Wednesday before the theme changed. And when I did this, this stuff popped up and like that theme hadn't even been released yet so i don't know if that was like meant to be that way and if next week's theme is also going to be here once they finish it before they release it but i thought that was pretty cool so <laughs> yeah also you know what? now i'm kind of realizing the separation of the guy and girl shop is kind of annoying because like what if you want to make an outfit with both guy and girl clothing then you have to keep like switching between the shops but I don't know because like really if they if they put both shops together I feel like it would be really messy and cluttered but who knows you know what else they really really need they need a way to search by like or to filter by low to high price or star coin and diamond or VIP and non VIP and stuff like that I think that would be really really helpful so yeah I just thought that all of that was really cool and worth sharing because I know a lot of people don't actually even have the downloadable version yet and i think some people just don't even plan on downloading it which is fine but i must be kind of making it sound like they're gonna keep on adding more stuff which i think is really great and i can't wait to see what else they add i'm really excited for that actually because it seems like they're finally listening to what we're asking for even though it's like it's really really late i mean better late than never right so <laughs> but yeah let me know down below what you think of these new updates and what updates you would like to see in the future and also make sure to subscribe like the video and turn on notifications. Bye guys!